What do you do for a living? Uh, I'm a senior scientist working at a pharma company. How much money do you make? I make around 155k a year, US dollars. Where do you stash the cash? Uh, probably high yield savings accounts, <laughs> investments. <laughs> okay, and what sort of education qualifications do you have? I have a, an, an undergrad, bachelor's in computer science, and I did this field called computational biology as a concentration. Um, and then I did a PhD in computational Whoa. biology. Yeah. This doesn't end. Just go on. That's it. Those oh, are the two okay. degrees. Yeah. Okay. That's <laughs> yeah, it. Yeah, that's like, it. okay. How many years of your education did it, like? At which point did you finish your PhD? Um, so undergrad, I did four years of uh, undergrad, and then I did um, four four years of PhD. Um, so yeah. you did so much, you lost the count. Yeah. I, uh, yeah. I, I, <laughs> I worked in the middle, I guess. So okay. it was a little bit. Okay. Fair um, yeah. So four years of PhD and four years of undergrad, so eight years total. Nice. How many years of experience do you have? Um, I have uh, two years of academic experience and okay. then um, I guess now a little over three years of industry experience. Right. And you're from Boston? Um, yeah, so I, I lived in New York City for the longest time. That's where I studied and partly grew up. Uh, I moved from India before that. Okay. Uh, to Which part of India? Um, Delhi. Okay. Um, and I recently moved to Boston for my new job like six months ago okay. or so. Yeah. That's crazy. So if I may ask you, there's any particular reason why you moved from New York City to Boston? Um, for the job, uh, okay. uh, Boston is actually a huge hub for biotech and pharma companies okay. and um, that's where I kind of apply my skills. Nice. So, Do you have any take on the housing crisis? So out here we're seeing that if you want to switch your house, you end up paying like 30-40% more rent. And is this the same case in Boston or New York? Uh, I would say so. I think people end up putting towards a very high percentage of their monthly salaries towards rent. Um, you rent or own? Uh, I rent. Okay. Yeah. You plan to buy something of your own anytime soon? Um, yeah, if, if I like Boston enough, maybe. Yeah. Uh, I'm still looking for, I guess, the city that I like. So yeah. Yeah. Okay. eventually, maybe, potentially. Okay. And that would be probably in the next couple of years? Uh, yeah, I would say so. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. 